All right, so with a new season coming out tomorrow, I really, I'm really, i kind of excited for this new season. We got to do the, obviously, annual where we kind of get my full thoughts regarding Battle Pass and my favorite seasons in this game. And yeah, let's go ahead and, and get this uh, started real quick. All right, so coming in at that number eight, my least favorite skin from the Battle Pass is Fish Thick. Now, first off, that name. I have that name though, that's all I gotta say, that name though. Anyway, uh, I'm not gonna be reviewing this, the, their entire set in this video, I'm just gonna be reviewing the skin and what my thoughts about the skin is, as that's the point of this video. Anyway, we got Fish Stick. Uh, I think the skin is not bad, it's just, it's not a skin I really don't like, nor I will never wear. I just, I'm just not a huge fan of this, I'm just, I'm just not a huge fan, that's all. It's. I mean, I can kind of relate to it a little bit as I'd be going to the gym, like, a little, uh, most of the time, so I can kind of relate to this game, but I, I, I ain't got, like, abs like that, I thought I'd say, but. <laughs> Alright, the skin is just weird. It's a weird skin, it's not a skin I'm not, uh, it's a skin I'm never gonna wear, probably. <laughs> it's just gonna be one of those dead in my locker type skins. But it does have Edda styles and whatnot, as Windrow style. That tank top is so stretched out. <laughs> Um, you got this style, it's like ready for combat and whatnot. It's kind of cool actually. And then you have a uh, beef cake, like beef cake. The meme, the memes based off of the skin is just kind of just funny and whatnot. Vindicator, and then just regular fish stick. He does have a hat as style, short little hat. Kind of reminds you of, um, I don't know, give me off Nemo vibes, like buying Nemo. And they got the normal version, and they got the shades. The shades kind of look weird on the skin, I'm not gonna lie. It does look really weird on the skin. Yeah, overall, it's just not my source skin. This it could be obviously good. I like this skin somewhat, and it's whatever. It's just not my preferred preferred skin. I'm just not into it. Like I said, I can relate to it in some way, but it's just, it's again, it's just a skin I never would rock like that. And that's why I come here at my least favorite. No way on me, but it's just it's just a skin I would never rock. Sorry, not sorry. Alright, coming in at number 7, we got Ahsoka Tano. Now, I feel like a lot of Star Wars fans are going to love this skin. And honestly, that's good for them. I, I respect them for this. I've never seen Star Wars. It's just a skin that I would ne never rock. Another Star Wars skin I would never rock. I mean, it's cool we have the character. I I, I know, with, if anything, I know a little bit about the character. I've seen this character from the show. So I kind of know who she looks like and what and kind of what she does. But I just never seen like the series or whatnot. It's basically similar to Darth Vader, where I I know who he is and whatnot. I just never watched the show, and this basically should be same same with uh, Osaka. So yeah, it's it's a whatever skin. I do like the backlink, but like I said, we're focusing on skin. Skin's just okay, to be honest. Simple skin. It's, it's whatever. Hair's kind of weird, to be honest. Face is whatever. But like I said, it's, I'm. I'm I don't know Star Wars like that, but I think skin's just okay in a sense, so yeah. Alright, coming in at number 6, we got Piper Pace. Now, I actually like this skin, to be honest. This, we're kind of getting to some skins I actually adore. <coughs> <coughs> oh my god, excuse me, what was that about? Anyway, we got the skin. Yeah, this skin's kind of cool, I'm to be honest. It's cool to see, like, I don't know, like a pizza delivery person. Yeah, Pizza Pit. I, I feel like we, if anything, I feel like they're trying to tease for next season because we have we're we'll obviously we're going back to chapter one, kinda. So it's kind of cool that we have this Pizza Pit, kind of like a I guess a little tease, I guess you want to call it. But yeah, we got this skin. This skin's kind of cool. I do like the skin. Like I said, I like the aspect of it and the skin and the that styles are pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, it's probably my least favorite. But I like this like sort of futuristic. Uh, Outfit she has on. It's pretty cool. I like it. This one's not bad either, but I do like this one uh, better. This is like cool, like neon, like pop, I guess, color, I guess you want to call it. <laughs> it does have some edit styles and whatnot. You can take off the, the big jacket and whatnot. It kind of looks weird with it without the jacket though, I'm not gonna lie. And then she has, you can take the hat off. You can just do it like this. You have nothing on. <laughs> or you just have just everything on. Uh, besides that, skin's cool, a lot of options, honestly. Same with, same with fish stick, but I, like I said, I don't rock fish stick, like fish stick or any case like that. 
but this is probably going to rock from time to time, to be honest. And I, I think that this skin is pretty cool to say at least. A lot of styles, why not? Cool to see. And I, I like the aspect of it. It was supposed to be like a pizza delivery girl. And I I, I think I like the skin. It's pretty cool. Alright, coming in at number 5. Or, yeah, number 5. We got Nolan Chan, so the original skin that he got. So, yeah, I feel like, I don't know. I feel like a lot of people don't like the skin. I'm going to be honest. I, I think I've seen a lot of people don't like the skin for some reason. I, I honestly, I don't know why. I kind of do enjoy. I think the skin is basic, but it's a good. I think it's a good sort of skin, to say the least. I think it's just sim something simple. Something it's some it's simple for casuals that just wanted to be standard. Not much like to it, like little edit style. Just something simple. I think the skin does well with it. Cool, basic. Got like a green white like cotton bat sort of wear. Got some what white or the white shoes, white band, something like that. <laughs> got tactical style this actually looks pretty sick i think this one uh i don't know because both of these styles are actually pretty cool this heist and this tactical style it's kind of cool right for combat and then you have this like white gold style kind of reminds me of uh the heist uh season so yeah i think this game's basic it's 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 basic not stuttering it's basic for any casual just people that just want to rock something simple but not like too flashy it's this skin, and i i think this skin is honestly it's simple, and I, I think it's, it's, it's some, somewhat cool. I, I think it's kind of cool. Alright, coming at number four, we got Antonia. Now, first off, props on the, the outfit. I'm not gonna lie. This, like, this, I, like, I like the description even, even too. It says destructive in design, or by design, or something like that. Let me see real quick. Destructive, yeah, by design. And, yeah, I, I, first of all, I do like the outfit. The outfit, like, what she has on. Snazzy and cool. I I think it's pretty nifty and like kind of like snazzy in a way. <clears throat> and the skin's pretty cool to be at the least. I actually like this skin. I feel like this skin might be a sweat skin to be honest, but that's besides the point. I think the skin is awesome. It's actually a pretty like snazzy, neat sort of skin and whatnot. I mean, haircuts I right, to be honest, but um, I think the skin's pretty cool. It does have a second edit style. It's actually a clean like silver style, which I actually like. And then here's the pink style, something create, uh, something simple, pretty cool, really enjoy it. <clears throat> and then here is the jacket style, but that's the, uh, yeah, jacket has to create cool, at least, it has to make them a lot better and whatnot. She has big shoulder pads, goddamn, <laughs> but kind of cool. And they have a mask style, which is something cool. I, it's a, it's one of, again, similar to Nolan Chance where it's a simple skin, but nothing too crazy. But I do like the skin a little bit better, just because of the design, not only because of the outfit, but the as well, she has are a lot more cleaner and cool, in my opinion, than uh, Nolan Chance. Alright, coming at number three, we got Kato Thorn. Now he's, oh my god, he's kind of simple regarding edit style. He has just like normally, like a transformation style and then a, a mask, which is whatever, but besides that, I think the skin for a tier 100, it's actually not bad to be the case. I actually kind of think it's cool. <coughs> Sorry, but yeah, it's cool. I love the transformation but for, for for this built-in emo by the way. Like that's so sick. That's 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 that's, that's cool, to say at least. Awesome ski. See. I remember uh when I saw the mask style, I really much as Spider-Man. I feel like that's what a lot of people got when they saw that mask. I think the the as well, the, like I said, the mask style is pretty cool and whatnot. It's a cool like effect. It's awesome. And he does, like I said, if you don't like it, you can take it off. Looks whatever without the mask, but I do prefer the mask on. Kind of looks cool effect with it. And then you have this as uh, which doesn't have the mask. Actually, does it? No, no. So it, it just belongs with this as style. So okay, I just had to make sure. But yeah, skin's cool. Whatever. Sets interesting. It's not bad the skin, to say at least. I, I think it's a pretty good to your heart skin. Props away for being an original skin, actually, as well. I normally like like skins are like hella like original to tier hundred, and this one's kind of cool as well. So I do adore the skin as well as like the built-in emo. But like I said, I think the skin is uh, simple. Transformations uh, with like between this and the what vampires like sword style is pretty cool. And if you and if it's fun, you can take the mask off. Simple, but a cool transformation and a style. Alright, coming at number two, we got May. Now, this skin, oh my gosh. This skin has really surprised me from this battle pass. At first, I was, I thought I was not going to like it. But when I 
used it in Locker, I was like, yo, this skin actually grew on me so much. I was originally going to place it, like, low, but this skin is actually pretty good, like, and it's such a comfortable skin to rock. It's, it's hard for me to explain, but it's a comfortable skin to rock. I like the outfit that she has on. It's pretty cool. Nice shoes and whatnot. Like, cool, a, cool, a chill fit, low-key. And she got a little fanny pack on. <laughs> And, but the edit styles and the, the stuff that she has with this, I was like, yo, this is a good, this is a pretty sick skin. It's a skin that I would honestly use from time to time, but it's a comfortable skin. She has this, like, like good style, which I actually really like. It's a really cool black and, like, purple style. Like, really cool, like, um, aesthetic skin sort of style. And they have this, like, pink, like, pop. Like, it, like it's like a pop sort of style, so it's kind of cool. But what I honestly find is shocking is obviously the vi well not only what kind of visor. visor I don't I don't use a visor so it's whatever. But the fact that you can change the 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 cell shading and whatnot it's really good. I've always liked that regarding skins like as of lately of cell shading skins where you can take the cell shading on on and off on how much you want it. And I really I I'm so glad that they've been doing that because I've been rocking either this style or the the cell shading style because both of them do look really good. Especially this one, I was like, yo, this actually looks pretty good without the cell shading. It looks really good, especially, like, with this. Yo, that's cool. So, yeah, this skin is really grown on me. I really, I really started to use this skin when I locked in. I was like, yo, this is an awesome skin, along with, along with her set. And I really do like this skin. This skin is really comfortable. And styles are really, are pretty good. And I like the, I love the option for the cell shading and like non-gradient cell shading. They should do that more often regarding cell shading skins. So it'll, it'll be really cool. But you love to see it. I, I think this skin really grew on me and I'm really surprised at, for it being at number two. All right, and coming at number one, we got KB Lane, Copy Lane. Again, hopefully I'm saying this right, but I think this skin is really cool. Um, obviously, if y'all know, huge. I like the outfit that he'd be wearing, the little futuristic combat sort of outfit he'd be wearing. I, I like this. Now, before I didn't even know who I I kind of I'm too honest. I didn't know who he was. I, I'm pretty sure a lot of people didn't know who he was when he first came into the game. Some people knew, but there's some people that were like didn't know who he was. And he was a TikToker, huge. I think he was, from what I remember, I think he was the he was the biggest follower on TikTok. So that's pretty crazy to think about. And I was like, I remember checking out TikTok before like the season came out. I was like, yo, this dude is actually kind of hilarious a little bit. <clears throat> I, think, I, I think he's pretty hilarious. And like I said, I'm a huge fan of this Ed style. This Ed style is pretty good regarding it being like the default style. Pretty cool. And then you have like um, this sort of style which really reminds me of Piccolo from Dragon Ball. It's pretty cool. I actually like, like the headband, like the gear. And then just similar to May, you can check, you can change the cell shading, which I really like. So yeah, this skin, I know it's simple, it, I know it's, it doesn't have much to it, but I just like the clothing of, of it. And I think it's it's a cool icon series skin, to be honest. Like, it's cool, to be honest. I, I like it. Yeah, I, I like it, honestly. It's simple, but it's I, I love the S styles. The cell, cell shading on and off is cool, and then you have this this guy style which I'm a fan of so yeah <coughs> excuse me that was my take on chapter 4 season 4 and yeah hope you all enjoy it like I said uh, by the way it's my opinion like I mentioned if y'all don't disagree with my, my opinion it's all good let me know what y'all thoughts on regarding this and other than that if y'all like this you feel me like and subscribe do what you gotta do but otherwise I will see y'all next time have a great day and have a great yeah have a great day peace